Hi, I'm Tom Mullaney. I'm here today to show you how ThingLink reads text to students. So you have a ThingLink and you have some text here. I have some text. And when you click on the card, you see this immersive reader icon. Click that. It opens a new window. And if I just hit play. On June 20th, 1789, the members of the French Third Estate who were locked out of so I'll just pause it there, but you see it works. And there's all sorts of settings too that students can play with. So text preferences, there's a lot of different settings here with colors. You can have it set to highlight, and you see what I just did there? Nouns are now in purple, how cool is that? And then there's some reading preferences as well. One called picture dictionary is on by default. Let me just show you that real quick. So picture dictionary is this, locked and here members. And so again, students can turn that off if they don't want that. There's also voice settings. So here, if I click that, I can adjust the uh, speed and I have two voices to choose from. How do I get back to my ThingLink? Because this is not ThingLink. I just hit this arrow right here. That is how ThingLink reads text to students.